in this example we are given with a statically determinate assembly in which the member 1 and member 2 are connected by a fixed joint the forces are given as follows 40 gips 30 gips 30 gips the diameter of this member is 2 inches the diameter of this member is 3 inches and the length of first member AB is 30 inches length of second member BC is 40 inches we are required to find out the stress in each member that is member A and member BC for finding out the stresses in each member we first require to draw the free body diagram of the member 1 and member 2 individually first drawing free body diagram of the member 1 we have 40 gips force and take this force as unknown for finding out the stress we apply the equation of equilibrium sum of forces in x direction is equals to 0 we have f is equals to 40 gips for finding out the stress is in this member that is member number 1 stress is equals to force over area we know that force is come out to be 40 gips and the area is pi r square the radius for this member is 1 inches since the diameter is 2 inches and it, the radius is 1 inches the stress comes out to be 40 over pi is equals to 12.73 kip per inch square that is the required answer for the member 1 now for member number 2, we draw the free body diagram in the similar manner we draw for member 1. We apply the same equation of equilibrium, sum of forces in x direction is equal to 0. We would say that is minus 40 gips and those 230 gip forces and again a plus force f. f comes out to be minus 20 gips. The negative sign shows that it is compressive member and here it was positive sign then it was tensile member. So the stress in this member number 2 would be found by the force in this member that is minus 20 gips over pi the radius for this member is 1.5 inches half of 3 the diameter is twice of radius so we half the diameter we get radius radius is 1.5 inch its stress comes out to be Per inch square. That is the required answer. Thanks for watching.